Hey guys, this is RSG Shadow Ninja here today, and I'm going to be doing a gameplay on Diablo 3 for the Xbox 360 console. Just showing you some uh, general gameplay of the game, and maybe even get a few of the achievements. The Diablo series has been far some of my favorite games of all time, <laughs> especially Diablo 2. I would have some uh, webcam footage for you, but my computer's being kind of funky right now. I don't know what's going on with it. Yeah, the the barbarian's definitely by far my favorite class in this game. A lot of them are they're all pretty equal. It just depends on your playstyle, I guess. I mean, I don't know. This uh, Act Two was definitely probably was definitely my least favorite out of the whole gameplay, though. This is just on the regular uh, Diablo Three, uh, the first version of it that came out for the 360. The expansion definitely uh, added a lot of really good game content. <sighs> I get some <laughs> bad little demons. Look, look, more hidden footprints. We get sidetracked here taking these guys out. <laughs> This is one of the 
cultist lairs. They are casting part of the illusion inside. <clears throat> I've been playing this series since the original Diablo. I always like the storyline. I don't know. Unfortunately, with this one, I feel like they added a lot of like Worlds of Warcraft and whatnot, like the more cartoonish uh, characters. I kind of Kind of wish that they would have kept it more dark, like the first and second one, like the more gothic appeal of it. It's still not a bad game, I just, there's some things that I kind of wish that they would have kept with it. But I mean, after that long a period of time with all the people that did the, you know, programming and whatnot for it, moving on or whatever... It was quite a while. I think it was like 12 years or so. Yeah, just let me know it's like feedback or whatever. I mean, I do like videos on almost anything. I'll continue uh, the making Diablo videos for you guys or like um, any other specific videos. Just let me know on my channel. of the prime evils. After the dark exile, he was contained within the Herodrim Tal Rasha. Tell me, what shall you I always definitely like the Templars, my favorite companion to have. So the fact that he can heal and whatnot. Hey, you may not do as much damage, but I like the support class of being able to keep me up. Yeah, I'm definitely a lot. 
I'm more of a fan of like a lot of RPGs. I don't know, I just like the fact that the time and detail and the fact that, you know, you can't just totally destroy the game in like a day. That there's so much replayability. And then, of course the fantasy like aspects of them. Being able to upgrade and build your characters. So most of like Call of Duty games you only get a couple perks or whatever and after a while, you know, the game is oh, it's over with. Especially after they really complete the campaign like once and really go back and play it again. Oh, it's like the appeal of like swords and old school sorcery and stuff like that. In Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah, usually, um, for like cheap games and whatnot, you usually go with Amazon. I've never gone, you know, never been stirred wrong by them at all. And now you can get a lot of the 360 and like even nowadays normal price like Xbox One games for pretty cheap. Especially if you like live on a fixed budget, you know, like most normal people do for it's something your kids want or anything along that lines. Yeah, just basically all about giving people like uh, game previews or anything along that lines, you know. So basically, you can decide whether it's something you may or may not want. Um, like I said, uh, just let me know on my game channel. Um, I try to post a video of almost anything related to the Xbox consoles, the 360 or the One.
need more time. Magda. <laughs> Magda in the flesh. Your illusions cannot protect you now. It matters not. Oh yeah, you're going down. Well guys, I hope you liked my video. This is RSG Shadow Ninja. Please like and subscribe to my video. Thank you.